So I haven't really uh, researched this much. I don't know if people remember the Jade Helm thing two years ago, and I don't know if people are putting the connecting the dots, but um, they were saying that Walmarts were being turned into FEMA camps, and this was in 2015. And Snopes, this website, man, they, they love calling out any conspiracy theory, and they love debunking it, and so far... Two of these uh, Jade Helm posts have not been debunked. It's just kind of like an open-ended discussion or debate or whatever. But um, one thing I found interesting on here was that this happened in Texas. And it was all a big operation, a big uh, martial law um, practice. And uh, that was what the whole controversy was about. And see, it says martial law. Let's see. Uh, so, talking about some exercises. Okay, so Walmarts were closed for plumbing, but yet they were being like gutted out. Like, I don't understand why a plumbing issue you would have to close the entire store. Um, they're talking about microchipping people. and But this is what I saw. It was interesting um, that it says something about an unrelated rumor about natural disasters was sucked in so we got something about natural disasters here then I look at another Jade Helm um, article here on Snopes and both these were posted in 2015 so this was two years ago talking about uh, the so-called FEMA domes across Texas this theory doesn't account for why Walmart stores in states far outside the geographic range of Jane Helm exercises e.g. Florida, Oklahoma. So we're talking about Texas and Florida here. And this is where these hurricanes are taking place. I don't know about Oklahoma. I, I don't have cable, so I'm really like behind on the news and stuff. But then you look at what's going on. Um, FEMA director says Harvey is probably the worst disaster in Texas history, Washington Post. So, did they know that this was going to happen? I mean, is, I don't know what they were planning for, but did they know that this was coming? And then you have stuff like the CNN reporter saying that these people are being held in a Walmart and that they're um, having to get used to this new world order. The process here to help them adjust to this new world order that they adjust to this new world order that they adjust to this new world order that they are to this new world order that they are they're going to be living in after this. And then this guy, uh, the news anchor goes up to him and asks him why he wasn't staying in a homeless shelter, and he gives this response. Well, I chose not to go inside yesterday because the Salvation Army and the Russian Winds homeless shelter where they were accepting people were caught killing everybody that was in there. We're caught killing everybody that was in there. We're caught killing everybody that was in there. We're caught killing everybody that was in there. So I don't know, man. It just seems weird. Jade Helm two years ago. Walmart's being shut down in Texas, Florida. Now we have hurricanes, the you know, the biggest disaster in Texas history. Just so happening in the places where these Jade Helm exercises were uh, being practiced and now we have people being housed in Walmart if, if I'm understanding correctly I haven't researched this much but this is just something to uh, talk about and I'm curious so if you guys got any input I'd love to hear it thanks guys